Hello, hello, hello everybody. Happy Sunday to you all. This is February favorites. Of course, I don't go out and shop a lot like a lot of other people do. But what I do, I try and find things that I really, really love. And first of all, right out here to my right, I'm just looking at the ocean. If I, if I, you know, veer off my glances to you, um, because it's storming out here and it's like huge 15 foot waves and it's like so cool. But anyway, back on to my February favorites. Um, mine are probably a little off the wall than most people, you know, they're going, this makeup I love. And I like a lot of makeup, don't get me wrong, but I, I can't afford a lot. And I'm sorry, I really didn't do my hair or anything this morning. But since it's been raining, raining here most of it, the last couple days, my first favorite is my Arc light cap um i think you remembered it in a previous video i trisha gave this to me when we went to a movie at the arc light and i'm not a cap person but i i really like this one it's comfy and i even wore it to work because i i'm a driver i drive right professional driver and uh it keeps my makeup from running and i don't always have to have an umbrella and i just let my hair go kinky or whatever for the day but it's great because keeps that rain off and you don't have to worry about you know having an umbrella and your purse and bags so this was my probably my top favorite okay not probably but it was my cap so I think I might be buying some more caps because I really really found them comfy and you don't always have to do the top of your hair especially if you know your hair is a little greasy on the roots really great thing okay now I was gonna say oh well she's too old to wear knee socks but i found these white knee socks two dollars and fifty cents at target you know they are so great like i like to wear a jean cutoffs a lot i don't wear a lot of jeans here i just i feel confined in long jeans so i wear a lot of skirts in that so i bought myself a pair of knee socks and i wear them with like my ugg boots like the gray um mid-calf ones really cute look especially with the dress too a little cute comfy dress um $2.50. I go back and I try to get like black and other colors from Target and they're always sold out. So obviously people are loving knee socks right now. Coming back. I remember wearing these in school, grade school. It's like, whatever. I love them. Don't matter what age you are. Okay. My underwear find of the month were these like cheetah plays. And these are of the Victoria's Secret. They're really comfy. They're hard to find, but they still have them. Um, they're a hip hugger. So, you know, they got a little coverage in the back. But these are 83% nylon and the 17% elastine. And then you can find them. But most comfortable I have ever, ever worn. And I like, I like the print. I usually get colors, but they had a really cute print. So, these are what I'm wearing this month. Well, of course, next month, too. I don't just throw them away like the stars wear them once. Whoop, off they go. Okay, here's something that you guys be like, really? Oh, but I kind of got into, like, a uh, scene on TV stuff. Sorry, just getting this stuff off my bar. And it's the Stuff's American Stuff Burger. I love burgers. And I saw this. It's like, you can stuff anything in a hamburger patty, I have found out, including... There's like mac and cheese, and you could do peanut butter and jelly. See the mac and cheese stuffed in there? But it's like you can stuff anything in there. You can stuff your cheese in there instead of putting it on top, and it melts all over your griddle and that. But anyway, I, I go in here now. I, where I go is Orange County Swap Meet, and they have this whole booth of us seen on TV. So I should make that a monthly thing, huh? But anyway, you put it in the press, and you smash it all together. And when you eat, bite into it, you have this delicately nice oozing surprise coming into your mouth okay enough of that um i do have i guess just oh two more things um uh, one is girls you you want to show your booty get you need uh, what is a must is these um uh, hug, body hugging butt hugging skirts i mean you can get them cheap you know 10 15 bucks and uh, they're um they hug your butt and you look good in them and this was only like ten dollars and i wore it for valentine's day with like a white cardigan it was so cute it was just adorable but you all i you can get these at q, uh, did i say q was one of them 
Um, I got this at like an apparel store. I'll uh, be on some apparel, what it was called. $9.99, I think this one was. But they're really cute. They go with anything. They're dressy and you can just, you know, run around in them. But if you want a booty looking outfit, get a nice fitting, form fitting skirt. This is one of my go-to skirts. I have a white one. I have a white one that has, you know, the fold down. It's more of a knit. Those are cute too. I don't have that to show you. And last but not least, it is this. Oh, no, wait. Well, okay, let me do the locket. The locket, I know it's not real. <laughs> but it was what my guy gave me around my roses for Valentine's Day. And it was just such a little extra little thing that I'm like, that is so cute. I'm not just going to wear it. I always wear my cross, but now I'm just always going to try and wear these together because I kind of like them both together. But... Guys, if you give your girl flowers, make sure they put something like this around it because, you know, it's just a little cutesy little touch to and for your girl, right? Okay, one more. Speaking of the Orange County swap meet, I love rings that just go halfway down your finger. I only wear like one at a time, but that's what I like. These are only like $4 or sterling silver, but they were always a thing. I used to... You, wear them on anything but I don't know my fingers are all swollen but anyway that is my February favorites into March this year is just going by it's gonna be summer before you know it but anyway sorry but I did see one more thing that I really love that is also uh, something from the blast from the past but an incense burner you know how you, I usually burn scented candles, but the incense burner thing is just, you know, you see, you see the smoke. I, in fact, I was sitting on the couch and I saw the smoke. I thought, God, it's just like clouds over my head from the incense burning. And it smells really, really good. It makes you mellow. I got this one. I think it was like $25, Orange County Swipe, but you can get them anywhere. It's got this, you know, the moon and the sun. But this one's really neat because you can store your incense right here at the end and then when you want one this one just you just pull it out right and all the mess goes inside instead of like putting it just out I used to put it like inside like a can <laughs> that was stupid because the ashes would get all over my bar but anyway and then you put it in like that you probably can't see it but you got to light it first and then put it in otherwise you burn the wood but Incense is so ba back, and I got like 35 of these sticks like for three bucks. It was just insanely cheap, but that is a good thing to have if you really want to mellow out an evening and just have a nice smelling uh, place, room, apartment, house. Got to have that. Reminds me, of, reminds me of the 60s. But anyway, okay, that is for sure the end of my February favorites, and... Um, can't wait to see all yours because I get lots of ideas. Lots of like, oh, I'm going to try that. In fact, I tried a lot of new stuff now for this next month. So stay tuned for my March favorites. And y'all have a good month. Bye.